Welcome back everybody to the channel. It's me, Alejandro Mendoza, Ordinary Chicano. Either way, how you say it, it's all good here. And we're back again for another video as we do our wonderful collection updates once again. It has been a while, y'all. I've been doing the Letterbox March Around the World Challenge. So I wasn't able to do much uh, physical media content for you guys. But today I'm back for another video and I'm going to be showing you everything I picked up during the Criterion flash sale the Melusine Valentine's Day sale, and something I picked up for my birthday. Of course, if you're new here and you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing to your channel. Click the notification bell so you don't miss a single video that drops on this channel. And of course, leave a like on the video as all of that helps me out so much as well. If you want to lend an extra helping hand, I do have a Patreon set up over at patreon.com slash Chicano, where you can get early access to videos just like the one you're watching right now, along with other cool stuff like video essays and other goodies I have available over there. Of course, it is not mandatory, but it is appreciated. Either way, I'm happy that you all watch these videos. I'm happy that you leave likes and I'm happy that you guys interact with me. So if you want to do that, you can. If you don't want to do the Patreon, then you don't have to. Now, let's go ahead and look at these purchases because I'm super excited to show them off to you guys. The first three purchases I made here are from the Melusine Valentine's Day sale. And I bought two Blu-rays and one 4K. And I decided to continue with the films of Roger Watkins. So the first one I picked up was The Pink Ladies. I am covering obvious stuff that I need to cover. But yeah, this is uh, The Pink Ladies on Blu-ray. And then I picked up as well the limited edition slipcover version of Her Name Was Lisa. And the 4K that I picked up was Melusine's first release under their Melusine label, The Tale of Tiffany Lust. Those were three titles I picked up during that sale. And I'm not going to be reviewing those here on this channel as the type of content is not allowed here. Uh, I'm actually going to start doing reviews of these Blu-rays and 4Ks over on my Patreon. And I think I'm going to be having them exclusive to the $5 tier and up. So if you want to get those reviews, you can go over to my Patreon at patreon.com slash Chicano to get those movies, uh, those reviews. But that's the only three that I picked up during the sale. I already watched The Tale of Tiffany Lust on 4K, so I'm going to be reviewing that very soon for the Patreon. Next is my only title I picked up during the Criterion Collections flash sale. And I was super happy to pick this up. It is a 4K set that I already said that I was going to pick up for a while now. And I love these movies and I'm happy to have them now and be able to cover them later on in the year for you guys when we get to them. But I picked up the 4K edition of the Apu trilogy from Sayaji Ray. And this is a great set. It has... Uh, the three films from this director called uh, Pater Panchali, Aparajito, and Abur Zanzar. And yeah, just a fantastic set. Uh, great films. I can't wait to watch these on 4K. I didn't, I, I didn't watch the uh, physical version. I watched the streaming version on the Criterion channel. So when I get to finally do these reviews, I'm going to be really interested to see what these look like on 4K Ultra HD. And finally, this last purchase was for my birthday that I picked up from Diabolic DVD. And it is another release from Second Sight. It is one of their 4K Ultra HD limited edition runs. And it is a film from Brandon Cronenberg. And that is their release of Possessor. This is fantastic, guys. I love the way this looks. And I can't wait to watch this. I did notice though that they made the box a little bit bigger than the one from uh, Crimes of the Future. So this is kind of slipping out like that. And it's having no trouble coming out like the other one. But uh, nonetheless, I'm really excited to get to watching this. I really like this movie. I've seen it before, but I have never seen it on 4K. And this already looks like a fantastic release. And just super excited. This is one of their... 4K Ultra HD limited editions that comes with the art cards and the booklet as well. So really excited for all of that. As you can tell, a lot of cool stuff here. But of course, if you want to see what this actually looks like, I'll have a review ready for you guys uh, later on in the year. And of course, that is it, guys, for everything I picked up from my last time we talked. 
I do have some reviews lined up that are coming down the pipeline for you guys. And I'm really excited to talk about those films with you all. But of course, if you guys would like to, go ahead and tell me in the comments what did you pick up for the flash sale. Did you pick up anything for the Melusine Valentine's Day sale? And have you ever seen Possessor? I would like to talk to you all in the comments and I would love to have a conversation with you guys. If you want to keep up to date with me on all things social media, make sure you follow me at The Nerdy Chicano on Instagram, Twitter, Letterboxd, Serialize, TikTok, Twitch, and of course here on YouTube. Make sure that we're keeping up to date with each other, interact with each other. I would love to have a conversation with you all over there. Keep up to date with my podcast called The Nerd Core by following us on YouTube, Twitch, and on Kick under The Nerd Core. We're the same handle for all those three platforms. So I would appreciate if you all would lend your viewership over there. I would love to talk to you all over there and have conversations with you guys as we've been reviewing some fantastic films and we've been doing some great stuff over there. But for now, I just wanted to give you all that quick little collection update and I hope that we all see each other soon for some more reviews. But in the meantime, to my wonderful cinephiles and renowned scholars, celebrate the love of cinema today, tomorrow, and every day after. Catch you all in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.